Hi, my name is Amel. I work for FWT, a center for women. And uh, thank you very much for allowing me to take part in this wonderful week, the Refugee Week. And uh, the book review I, I chose to contribute with is one of the very lovely books that I read recently. And uh, it touched my heart. It's called Lion, A Long Way Home by Sheru Bridley. The review is at the age of five, Sheru, who's an Indian boy, becomes lost after being separated from his brother. After traveling on a train for quite some time, he ends up in a part far away from home, very far away from home, a different part of India. He has no idea of his surname or the village he came from. And that made it extremely hard for him to make his way back home. After being in an orphanage for quite some time, eventually Sharu's life takes a turn for the better. After being adopted by an Australian couple who took him to live in his new home with them. His adoptive parents were fantastic, wonderful, loving people. And they did everything they can to make Sharu feels at home. Sharu settled very well, and he grew up to have his own ambitions and successful career. I thought, what a remarkable story to share with you all about never giving up. This was an inspiring and heartwarming story that I thoroughly enjoyed, and I highly recommend reading that book. It's again called Lion, which actually means Sharu, his name. A Long Way Home by Sheru Bradley himself. And I thought that following the footsteps of staying positive and embracing new opportunities and life with big open arms is a great way to celebrate our Refugee Week by sharing this book, which is exactly reflecting those ideas. Thank you very much, and I hope we have a fantastic week celebrating in different ways. Bye-bye.